What's going on ladies and gentlemen, welcome to a new video. Today I wanted to talk to you guys about eight G Fuel flavors that have been silently discontinued. We talked about five flavors a little bit ago um, and these are another eight that I've noticed that have just kind of disappeared. You can't order them anymore. They're not just sold out. It says unavailable or they're not even on the G Fuel website anymore. Now, if there's any others that you guys would like me to talk about in a upcoming video, let me know. Um, most of these you guys actually told me about in my recent video. So thank you guys uh, for uh, letting me know about some of these. But anyways, guys, let's go ahead and get right into it. Now, the first one is actually one that I mixed up because this is probably the one that I miss the most right now. And to be honest, I've been like recently recommending this one. Um, I didn't even know that it was gone, but I checked it out and it says it's it's gone. It's not even listed as sold out. It's listed as it's unavailable. It's no longer, you can't buy it anymore. And most likely when it says that, it's not gonna be restocked. So I'm guessing something happened with the orange mango flavor um, where it was, I don't know, maybe it was a very short deal or something like that, I don't know, but it looks like this one is no longer available. Yeah, so this was only available for a few months and then all of a sudden it's just gone. So super, super weird, but this has definitely been one of my top flavors that has come out recently. It's got a mango that is very similar to the mango and peach mango. And then the orange is super, super good. It's like a real, like fresh squeezed navel orange taste. It is just a super, super good flavor. And I, I can't believe it's already gone, but I would say I definitely want this one to come back, but they need to reskin it um, and just give it some good, like fruit based art. I think this could be like a staple in G Phil's lineup. Like give it just some good fruit-based art, maybe bring it in packets as well. It's just such a good flavor in my opinion. Now next up, we have hibiscus tea. This one did not come out too long ago and it's already gone. I don't know why, maybe it didn't sell well. Um, this one did have quite a bit of hype because G Fuels, they've never done a hibiscus and they haven't ventured into too many tea flavors. So whenever G Fuel drops anything tea based, I feel like it does really well because they don't do that often. Now, in my opinion, hibiscus tea was not as good as I thought it was gonna be, but I definitely saw a lot of people that liked it. So I was for sure sad to see it go. And the art was amazing as well. Next up guys, this is the Summit 1G Raspberry Creamsicle flavor. I'm guessing Summit's G Fuel contract ended or something like that um, because this one is no longer available. And in general, I don't really see Summit promoting G Fuel much at all, even when this came out. And I'm not sure why. So it looks like maybe their contract has ended. So I do see on Summit's YouTube, he has the G Fuel logo on his banner, but it might be outdated because I don't see anything in his description or anywhere else. So I'm guessing, I think just his contract has ended with G Fuel. So next up guys, I wanted to talk to you about Zitz Juice. Uh, it looks like this one's gone. It looks like it's sold out and discontinued. I didn't think this was gonna be a long lasting flavor either way, to be honest. Um, I think most of the collabs with like these really old video games and stuff like that, if they don't do insanely well, um, they're probably going to last the minimum time of whatever that exclusive contract is. So m most likely Battletoads was like a six, six to 12 month contract or something like that. I wasn't crazy about the flavor, so I'm not like super sad to see it go, um, but definitely let me know what you guys think about that one. Next up guys, I wanted to talk to you about Key Lime Pie. This one also didn't come out that long ago, but it looks like Glad is no longer with G Fuel. Just judging by his socials, it looks like he is now with a different energy drink company. So Key Lime Pie, I don't know if we will ever see it back. If we do see it back, I would like to see it taste a little bit 
more zesty lime. Like I just felt like it could have been a lot better than it was. And this one has come and gone a ton of times and I don't know why they just don't leave it because clearly I think people really like it and it sells out every time that it comes out. That's Nemesis Tea. I don't know, I think what, it's been maybe three, four times that it's been re-released and redesigned. So I'm not exactly sure why they keep doing that because people obviously really, really like it. Now, if you guys don't know, Nemesis Tea is basically an Arnold an Arnold Palmer. So it's like a lemonade with an iced tea. It is an amazing flavor. And I think what they should do, maybe change it up, make it with natural colors, no artificial colors or anything like that, and reskin it to have just this awesome like lemonade iced tea art. I think that would be awesome and do really well uh, for sales. Because sometimes you look at this and it's just Nemesis Tea, you know, to the to your average consumer, they're like, I don't really know what that is. Um, so I think a proper reskin and maybe with no artificial colors could go a long way with it. Next up, guys, this one is the Rick and Morty flavor. This one did insanely well. A ton of people bought this one. So there was some stuff that went on with uh, Rick and Morty in the news, and I think that's why G Fuel kind of moved away from it. I don't know if they are going to reskin it or something like that, um, but that is as much as I know about the flavor. It was a pretty decent flavor. I, I'm not insanely sad to see it go. I thought the collab was really awesome, and I definitely thought there could have been more collabs with Rick and Morty, um, you know, if things, if what happened didn't happen, but let me know what you guys think about that one going away. Now, the final one that I wanted to talk to you guys today is the Honey Berry G Fuel flavor. I thought this was a really good flavor. It is super, super sweet, but it is good. It is just such a great honey flavor and the berry. It's just super good. It tastes just like the Haribo gummy bears. I freaking love it. I really, really like this flavor. I don't have it too much just because it's so sweet, but boy, is it a really awesome flavor. I think they should reskin it, make like this cool, like melty honey gummy bear art. And with like, I think that would be awesome. Do something like that or do a real collab with Haribo gummy bears. I don't know. I just think there's so many opportunities for a reskin. I think that would be awesome. So. Out of these eight that I talked about today, let me know which one you guys want to come back. Thank you guys for watching this video. And if you guys uh, use code SHOCK recently on any of your G Fuel orders or you pick up any TikTok shop G Fuel orders, watching through my videos or my live streams on there, let me know. Um, I will definitely put those up on the screen. But anyways, ladies and gentlemen, thanks for watching. Peace out.